Hey drone technology fans, Bill here. I got another Mavic Pro 2 update coming right up. Hey drone technology fans, Bill here. Before I get to the update, uh, Ostelev put out, he was flying uh, a Mavic Air and took a video of that and I'll put a link to that on there, but also got to see who he is. So I'll put a still frame, um, still picture of him up here. There you go. Take a look at him. Also found out he's 30 years old and he's single. And if you want to go check out any more personal information on it, um, please do on, on, his, on his Twitter link. And again, I'll put a link in the description so you can check that out. Got another Mavic Pro 2 update. It seems every day there's something new coming out on the Mavic Pro 2. So again, I'll put these, there are two of them, and I'll put them up on the screen here. First one says Mavic Pro 2 could be equipped with a 24 millimeter lens same as Phantom 4 Pro, just a wild guess. The other tweet was, in conclusion, Mavic Pro 2 is bigger Mavic with Phantom 4 Pro inside, or saying, or another saying, a Mavic-shaped, foldable Phantom 4 Pro, so it'll be more expensive. Unfortunately, it also means Phantom 5 will be more expensive too, could be over $1,999 USD, even more. Okay, so we, we got some things out of there. Basically, what we're getting, hearing from Ostelev here, is you're getting a Phantom 4 package in the Mavic Pro 2. Uh, 24 millimeter lens, same as the Phantom 4 Pro. That's, that's incredible. That's a, that's a good, very good lens. Um, you know, he did say, you know, the Mavic Pro 2 is a bigger Mavic with a Phantom 4 Pro inside. And again, you know, this is not only, this is about maybe the third or fourth time he's actually mentioned this in some of these tweets. So, um, you know, for all of you who are kind of guessing and wondering as to what this Mavic Pro 2 is going to look like, it's going to look like, you know, according per his renderings, it's going to look like the Mavic Pro. There's not going to be a lot of difference there. However, it is going to be bigger. And it's also going to be beefier in terms of the capabilities of it. It's going to mimic basically is what he's saying a Phantom 4 Pro right now, which is very exciting news. Um, you know, and I think the one thing, you know, I'm waiting on to hear is rear obstacle avoidance. Uh, that's one of the things. Um, you know, there wasn't on the renderings, there wasn't anything indicated. And from what he said on the prototype, there wasn't a rear, a rear sensor on there. So, you know, that remains to be seen. But from everything that we're hearing and everything that we're seeing is that they're gonna, there's going to be a March release date on it, a late March release date. And again, that's what I'm thinking too in terms of now. I think DJI is going to be extremely aggressive this year in the market. Um, you know, is um, regarding regarding products. Um, you know, they just um, have 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 just taken over the consumer market as far as drones are concerned. I mean, there is nobody I would even consider close. Now, of course, you know, Autel is coming out with the Evo, but again, you know, since CES, they've been very quiet regarding this. So we'll remain. That remains to be seen. That's another. That's a whole another 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 topic. But. This is exciting news. Uh, the Mavic Pro 2, um, I'm really thinking it's going to be worth what he's talking about in terms of a price point. And I've seen a lot of comments on that in the previous video. My question for you this video, and again, thank you all so much for your thoughtful, insightful comments. You, you, you've been spot on with them. You know, I asked you regarding price of the Mavic Pro 2. My question for you is this. With all the equipment that's been revealed, um, even without the rear sensor on there, the rear obstacle avoidance, is the Mavic Pro 2 something that you would purchase? You know, I'm not asking about price. Basically, what I'm asking here is that all the equipment that's been revealed, and including what I've mentioned today, is that something that you would buy? Please answer that comment. Uh, please answer this in the comment section. I would, I'm really curious to know. And again, thank you all so much. Build the Drone Reviewers channel has been growing by leaps and bounds. I, you guys drive me to do this wonderful comment. Thank you all so much for your insightful comments. I really appreciate them. I do this, I do this for you guys. I love drones. I love drone technology. You know, this is a passion of mine and it, it, I hope it comes through. I hope you guys can see that. If you like today's video, please make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and definitely tell others about our channel. Also, be sure to check out my Facebook page where I do post daily updates regarding drones and the drone industry 
Also, my blog where I do the same and also all these videos that I do go out on the blog to, get, to make sure everybody knows that there's a new video out there. Thanks so much for watching and happy flying.